Hello, I'm Ken Domic and I'm with KBD Productions TV and today I'm going to be taste testing Twirl. It's a British chocolate bar from the UK and I got this from Sweets and Store. It's a British import store in Newmarket, Ontario. They gave this to me the last time I was down there to give it a shot, let you know what I thought of it. Uh, there, these, it's almost like a Twix bar, like it has two fingers in it, as they say. And the British have really cool things on their packaging, like be streetwise, know or get to know your GDAs. So it's 115 calories per chocolate finger. It says the intense chocolate hit. The uh, the British Cadbury's likes to put uh, uh, best before date on it. So it's going to be best before, looks like October 15th, 2013. So there are two chocolate fingers in here. And there's not a lot of ingredients, which means it's going to be pretty good. Not a lot of like preservatives and stuff. Ooh, I just dropped it. I promised my daughter I'd give her one of these. So, and my son. Mmm, maybe it isn't just all chocolate. I've Maybe it is, I don't know. I was told that it might be like one of those flake bars. So it's all flaky chocolate and then dipped in chocolate. And of course it's from Cadbury's in Europe, so it's gonna be amazing chocolate. Okay, here we go, let's give it a shot. Mm-hmm. Cadbury's makes great chocolate, man. Wow. It gets stuck in your teeth. It's so creamy and rich. And it's got the, it's all flaky. Mmm. Next time you're in downtown Newmarket, give Twirl a shot at the Sweets in Store British Imports downtown Newmarket. All right, guys? Thanks for watching. Don't forget to. Subscribe, comment, rate, follow me on Facebook, Twitter, Google+, share the video if you like. But I definitely give this um, a 10 out of 10 for chocolate bars. And uh, this would definitely taste good with the chocolate milk to help wash it down. The combination would be fantastic. Again, thanks for watching, guys. See you later. Hello, I'm Ken Domic. I'm with KB, KBD Productions. Oh, don't even know my own name. It's just hard to say all the time.